if you can have a chance to compete one time in life, I recommend. Because it's completely different than everything. You know, maybe you don't have the design, but you feel the energy. Maybe you have the design and then you keep going, move forward. You know, it's unbelievable. You can't even describe it. How the, the time you inside the four lines. It's amazing. I think one of the best things in my life, you know, actually to grow up in the family I grow up, we always compete each other in the nice way, you know, we have a lot of brothers, a lot of cousins home all the time, and that's the beautiful in the art, you know. My father always create, you know, like a challenge inside the house. It make us train, it make us motivated. No matter what, he always there to support us. And that's the, the best part, you know. The time you got the family close to you and help you, no matter what happened, nothing better than that, you know. I think I do my part in, in a sport competition. Uh, I can say I'm on the most compete, you know, because I do because I like. You know, I have the design, I love to be there, inside the four lines. It makes me feel comfortable, make me feel excited. At the end of the day, who win? That's the one that people recognize, you know. It doesn't matter if I win by advantage or for a point or if I finish. In 10 years, the people know who this guy or These guys win 1996 because they know he win. They don't remember the second place. In my time, maybe the people's looking for more the finish and then it's more forward. And today is a lot of it's smart, it's strategic, and you know it's all the details, all the, the the advantage make a difference. But uh, let's go back a little bit. My father, they fight a lot, and then if that's the one, make the tree grow up, and then we take the fruit from the tree. You know, but if it's not him, we're not gonna be here today. And then I can say the same thing for Carson, for Hollis, you know, for my brothers, you know, Horion, as a Hoyce, you know, Hickson, my brother Hoke, the one in Brazil. We always work together. It doesn't matter if you compete or not, but then in one way or the other way, we give your own contribution, you know. And everybody I think is a proud, you know, what they do. I used to train every time I have a chance, every day I'm home, I just, just put my gear in my shoulder, walk to the academy like everybody else, change my clothes and roll a little bit if I have a chance, if I'm not cheat. Oh yeah, that's just the amazing thing because you become a student again. And that's the only time you develop the movements and you adjust your movements. You know, I still do this today, yes, I love to do that. I'm not being the academy trained only with the black belts and brown belts. I train with everybody, white belt, blue belts. It's a good not only for me, but I, that's a good advantage for everyone. If you like to make your game better, try to train with everybody. And then the guys are lower technique than you. This guy's gonna help you a lot to make your game adjust. And that's what I like to do, you know. Spend my time, make sure I feel comfortable, enjoy, having a good time. The belt, I think, make you looking old. That's the, that's for sure. 
But uh, like my father said, the belt is to type the gear. You know, of course, you got a lot, a lot, a lot of a knowledge, a lot of detail, a lot of details. But I don't think it makes you better than nobody. You know, and that's kind of the education I have from my father. You know, make sure you respect. You know, and then you can get anything you want. And then he's right. You know, Jiu Jitsu gave me a lot of things and still give it to me. You know, if he's not a the Gracie brothers, you know, the old Gracie brothers like Carlos and Helio Gracie, we're probably not here today. You know, and then I see some people, they not appreciate that. And uh, I just like to say one more time, thank you, Daddy. Thank you, my Uncle Carlos, you know, to give you that. A lot of people, you know, good life is a beautiful lifestyle and put the food in some people's plate, you know. Before I left Brazil four years ago, I go there and visit my father and, and his ranch. And then I told him, say that, I'm gonna go to America. Then he say, well, that's good. You're a good teacher. I said, no, 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 I'm actually trying to ask you, what are you thinking about? And then he say, the people don't stop to eat. I say, can you be a little more specific? I don't understand. And he say, Jiu Jitsu, olha. it's a very small amount compared with a lot of big things. And the time is a reception. The people stop to buy a big boat. They stop to buy big cars. It's a change the house. But they don't stop to invest in yourself. Every time you train, I'm talking about Jiu Jitsu because I'm, I'm a Jiu Jitsu guy. But every time you do something for you, and that's the only time you forget your bills. You forget somebody sick at home. You, so you forget the problems you have. And this small amount, you don't remember that, you know, but uh, it's actually two hour and a half, two hours, you recharge your energy for the next 24, maybe 48 hours. But in this hour and a half, it's only for you. And the people, they don't realize how important, small amount, you know, it's change your life. And not even today, the people's coming to me, you know, I, I bet, you know, talk to my father the same way. Jiu-Jitsu changed my life. Well, it still changed mine. <laughs> you know, it's amazing.